one. Um, this is a video to show you how to make pay like uh, we are aware of several of business runner people who run Facebook ads or Instagram ads are finding it hard to pay for their Facebook ad using their MasterCard. I did a video on how you can use your now MasterCard and so you can watch that video on my YouTube channel. But today I want to show you another way whereby you can still use a dollar card. Possibly your home card here in Nigeria is a Naira card. You might be having issues, surprise, maybe you have some payment to be and while you are using your Facebook card, you discover or you notice that your card is no more working for Facebook card. There are several options. So here today we'll be using a new payment method called Bata. Bata is created well, by Flutter Waves. So all what you need to do for Bata is to create your Bata account of uh, here, which I have a Bata account already, so I create a lot of it. So you need to create a Bata account for yourself. Uh, creating a Bata account is that easy. Uh, you just register for an account. So let's try. Let me try to show you that. All right. Okay. I'm logged in ready to my Bata account. You have to register, create a new Bata account. Uh, you be requested to have your phone number and an email, and then you receive a code to your email. Good. So immediately you open your Bata account. You can see I'm told to phone my Bata account. There's a tab for card transaction, airtime, and settings. So when you open your bar account, you have to pay attention to a few things here. Firstly, you have to go to your settings and you will have to verify your account. What you need to do in your verification account is to add your DVN. And then you add your date of birth, then you are going to continue. Someone is asking, is this a because it's on Flutter Wave? You are not going to have issues using your BVN, or was it just to verify account with your BVN and your date of birth? So I'm going to put my BVN and my date of birth right there, right now. All right, so immediately I will show you enter five digit OTP that is sent to my phone. All right, immediately I did that, I received the OTP that I sent to my phone. So uh, all right, those of you who always come through the email, so your message um, here, the um, unfair or WhatsApp. So I'm going to put in the OTP right now on my number. All right, okay. So uh, my account is verified. I see it's no more here. My account is actually verified. And everything is done. You can proceed and create a pin for yourself. Uh, just to type in your pin. Uh, yes, your pin, but it's not that necessary. So after you're done with this, you go back to your home page and fund your Bata balance. So are you ready? Right. So you just go for the Bata balance. This is how much you want to put into your Bata balance. So you can have. 500, you can try 1000. So I'm gonna try with uh, it's a leaf for just to see. So we can continue and it's gonna bring you an option to phone with my Naira MasterCard. My card is gonna work here so I can pay with USSD, I can pay with my bank. You can choose your bank. Whether you use a post bank or GT, or you can pay with your card. All right, so after my card, this was exact that I'm paying. So I just click to proceed so that I can have a seamless process to be done. Then I'm using my UBA card. What I need to do is just to process my 
with a car that uh, depending on the car that you're working with so we allow that to work through and that take us to the next phase all right so uh my, 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 my dashboard has been from there so i have 500 uh i can i always advise you can try a thousand uh total money you see total money spent so i have the money my account so that will take me to the card section just like you do with your regular buy you can put your shopping amount or that account so what i'm doing here is to create the equivalent of my card so i'm just going to go to create new card how much money do you want to fund your bank with so here it is advisable to have a money that is less than what you have please pay attention to this put the equivalent of what you have in your data balance in dollars that is what it's going to have here but it must be lesser because there's no time to be more exchange dollar exchange in naira so here if I say well, I have 500, 500 is more equivalent to one dollar. Actually, we know Nigeria currency at this moment is between 360 to 400. So if I say one dollar, I'm see okay. So let me just take it one dollar. This is it. That's so I'll just say one dollar, and uh, you'll be charged at 400 US dollar. Please know that this includes an additional card creation fee. And so there's a charge for that then you click on create new card all right the minimum account i can fund my card which is five dollars so um like i said this is a test so which means i have to have more than that from here able to have so let's see if it's going to go if i have the five dollars but i don't have a that in my balance okay all right okay let's see how that works all right so which means the five dollars i have this is the exact amount of five dollars so i will need to fund my account to be able to create the exact amount of five dollars so the minimum we can have for that is to have five dollars and there's a charge for that which is nice but yeah it's just to uh, i couldn't get this straight to everybody here but this is just to show you that with this you can create a dollar card and uh, you'll be charged three thousand at four hundred seventy to one dollar all right so the chart here is for one dollar is four hundred seventy two so good one four hundred seventy two five dollars is going to give you two thousand two sixty you'll be charged yeah, so same way we put the four dollars there you see the payment there you'll be charged two thousand to your cards please know that this includes an additional cash creation of nine four four so uh okay the lowest year is the lowest i can find here the minimum of times you can fund the time which is five dollars so so if I'm going to make five dollars, I must make sure I have that exact amount. So creating a new card has made that easy. So I'll be charged three four on a centimeter to a dollar a year of data, and the total charge is two thousand three hundred sixty plus the charge of the card year, which is nine four four nine four four. That's what make it. We have three thousand three. Of the four, and when I'm done, I can create a new card. Now, when I click on create a new card, because I don't have that exact amount, that is why it's taking me to make that payment. So you can get your hands, uh, get this done, and uh, when you fund that, what you are going to have is this. All right, back to our home page, back to our card details. Uh, what you are going to have is. You are going to have a card number and your card ccp so you're going to have a value true this is my card number and this is uh my value true and my card number is there and also my card cpp 
All right, you can't use this, uh, for somebody who will try to use this. So, all what you're doing here is just credit card. So, you can now go back to your Facebook payment page and insert your PIN, your number, the CVV, and to make your payment. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you're able to get through this, and I would love you to share me with your details. This has made payment easy. Though Batter come up with its own charges, but I feel the charges is affordable. Though the Nera equivalent app is still make it more safer to make sure you have more money. And when you are creating your dollar, make sure it's equivalent to dollar and it's less than what you have in your Batter account. So play with that, get it done, just get your card details number and what you are having is just a virtual card that you cannot touch but you can have the details to make your facebook payment all right thank you guys for watching